Okay, in this video, we're going to take a look at how to make a 3D trapezoidal building in Revit. So all of the walls will be slanting in or out in this case. And it's going to start with the massing element. So if I go to my elevation here, um, I'm adding in a third level on my drawing. I'm going to have the very peak of it be the top of the trapezoid slanting in to a wider base on level one. So I'm going to start in level one here, go to the massing and site tab and say in place mass. With in place mass, I'm going to say OK. I'm going to go and draw out the base of my building. So let's say, for example, I want it to be, um, let's say, like 20 by, by 30. I can go and I can change uh, change that up to be the exact dimensions that I want. Um, here I drew the uh, actual geometry before typing in that. And uh, it can be a little bit more difficult than to get the sizing that you want. So what I'm going to do here is actually delete that back out, click in, and really pay attention to these measurements as I go. I find it to be a lot faster. So I'm going to go down and 30 by 20. There we go. Now to make it easier for myself, there's a few ways we can do this. Um, I can go and I can set in like a reference plane or some reference lines. Uh, for um, for making this model. So that way I can see where this base lands on level three. So I can go and I can make a plane in here, come over and around with that plane, all the way through and around. And then the other way to do this is we can go into the settings on level three and just make sure that we can see level one. Now I can also offset. And so let's say I know I want the base of this, the top of it to be um, five feet uh, shorter all the way around. I can go ahead and do that and click and draw my second set of reference plans all the way around. Now if I go to level three, I can see these reference plans really easily without having to adjust my view. So I'm just going to go and draw in the top of my structure. Then in 3D, Let's just orbit around so we can see what that looks like. And I'm going to escape, highlight both of them, and say create form, solid form. Now we have the trapezoid that we were looking for um, with our uh, top centered. Obviously, that can be any geometry you want. We're going to finish the mass so now that it's here. And then I'm going to actually take this right now, right click, and say hide and view element. And then I'm going to have the light bulb on now to show the hidden element under the Massing and Sight tab. I'm going to go and make wall by face. I can go any wall type I want here. Um, so let's just say like, I don't know, uh, exterior brick on CMU metal stud. Any wall that I click on will then become that element. And I'm going to go and unhide or un unlook at my hided mass. And, or my hidden mass. And now here I see I have my brick wall. If it turns inside out, obviously uh, I just hit spacebar on it and you'll be good. And let's see, we have some different elements here in our options bar. Everything looks good. And then all I have to do is escape out and go back out. And now I have my building that's a trapezoid. Don't forget to save and subscribe.